Good morning, everyone. If you're new here, my name is Katie and I am a third year teacher in the Bay Area, California. And this is day two of classroom setup. Okay, so today is starting a little bit slower because I have an eyebrow appointment at 1030. And so I figured that I would get a lot of stuff done here this morning. It's currently eight o'clock. I've been up for actually kind of a while for like two hours now. And I've been editing yesterday's video because I want to get it up in a little bit. I'm going to leave and head to Michael's and Target um, and then go to my eyebrow appointment. And then from there, I'll go to the school. So that is kind of the plan. I wanted to go to school earlier this morning because the juniors are checking in and like they're getting their schedule and their picture taken. And those are like my group of kids that I am their class advisor for. So I wanted to go in and like say hello to all of them, but it doesn't really make sense for me to like go all the way to the school just to leave. Anyway, so I'm editing right now, but I thought I would just start the vlog here because this is realistic. Also, I have a bruise right there. Okay, I actually take it back from what I just said. I'm realizing I'm just sitting here editing and I do wanna see some of my students. So I'm gonna go to the school and I'll just edit in my classroom and then I'll just leave early for my appointment. Anyway, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna pack up and I'm gonna go. Okay, I thought I'd do a little fit check. Honestly, <laughs> there's kind of a lot going on. I have these shorts that are pretty long. I wouldn't be able to wear them for like school, but I could wear them for prep work, you know? These shorts, I have like a thick strapped white tank top I got from Target, fanny, my lanyard, my school backpack is on with my laptop and stuff like that. I have my Velcro Vans, which I was wearing yesterday and my cup that I bring everywhere. So let's go to the school. Okay, I just got to my classroom. Um, anyway, I just got here, like I just said. <laughs> I honestly kind of felt excited coming in here today. When I walked in, I instantly was like, oh my gosh, <laughs> I have so many ideas. Um, yeah, <laughs> Katie. I can't think right now. Anyway. Okay, so I told you guys that I need like a new teacher desk or a co-teacher desk or a TA desk or another desk, okay? And I just saw the custodians drive by. I think they might be bringing it up into my room right now. So let's see. I did end up getting a table and desk delivered, but I have to leave to go to appointments. So I'll show you guys that after I get back. So I have my eyebrow appointment right now. So you'll get to see me looking real nice after this some new eyebrows. And then I am gonna go to the store. I have a couple different stores I wanna go to. Like I, oh, that hair. Like Michael's, Target, that fun stuff. All right, so I just finished my eyebrows. I stopped at Office Max because it was right next to the place I get my eyebrows done at. And I printed out a whole bunch of new quotes for my quote wall because you know, the ones I had from two years ago, they're still great, they just, need a refresh so i got those and now i'm thinking i'm gonna go to target and then again just see where the day takes me okay i'm back from shopping and honestly guys i got a lot of good stuff so i'm at the school i parked right by my classroom so i'm going to have to take a couple trips and bring some stuff in so i'm gonna do that it's really hot outside it's literally 102 degrees yesterday was hot today's even hotter wonderful okay everything is unloaded let me show you guys what i got okay so this is the strangest angle but this will have to do i think i already told you guys this can't remember but i printed out a whole bunch of new quotes for my little quote wall that i put on my door over there so uh, then i went to where did i go next target i think i went to target next okay so first thing i got is this little weekly planner from the target dollar spot only five bucks this has nothing to do with my classroom, but I'll show you anyway. These cute sandals. How freaking cute these are. I love them and they were on sale. I got another one of these tank tops. It's the exact same tank top I'm wearing. They're only $5, so got another one. I also got four of these little paper bins. A lot of teacher supplies I can't really get because they're very um, like elementary. This is kind of elementary, but I just thought the pink is really fun. And then what else did I get from Target? Oh, I got this. This was such a steal. Five bucks from the Target dollar spot. It's this big sign that says welcome. I think you're supposed to paint it, but I'm not going to. Last night I went to TJ Maxx and I found the coolest thing, okay? Literally the coolest thing. Check this out. It's this ginormous huh, macrame. It's huge and it was only $40. I don't know where I'm gonna put it. I, I really don't know, but it is so freaking cute. I had to buy it. Like. 
I had to get it. It was just not even like an option in my mind. Then I went to Big Lots and I ended up buying one of these really big chairs. Again, I don't really know why. I didn't need it, but I think these chairs are fun, okay? And then lastly, I went to Joanne and I was wanting to redo this one area in my classroom. Let me show you. Up here, I used to have this poster. Now it's on the ground. And I wanted to put like block letters, kind of like how I have math over there. And then on this wall, I have block letters spelling out like a word or a phrase. So I put a poll on my Instagram and I had so many people give me advice, like so many ideas. But I decided to spell out the words, you matter. So I just bought a whole bunch of these wooden letters. I'm deciding if I'm gonna paint them or not. So I definitely don't have to paint them, but I thought maybe I would paint them. I went and I got paint that matches these posters up here. So that is everything that I bought and I'm kind of ready to like get going, but I'm also starving. It's 109, I need to eat. So I'm gonna eat my lunch and then we're gonna get down to business. Okay, so I just had some of my students come by and they were like, Miss Johnson, there's lemonade for sale in the quad because it's like the day that kids come and take their picture and all that stuff. So apparently there's lemonade in the quad. So I'm going to get that. It is so hot. I think it's hotter today. I already told you that. I don't remember. Got my lemonade, finishing up my lunch, finishing up editing, and then I'm gonna get to work. So basically, I didn't ever show you guys the desk that I got delivered. Here's my teacher area. Again, it's a mess, so don't, it's not finished, okay? They delivered me this um, big wooden desk. It is very large. However, I do have a lot of kids and or TAs that come into my room and either hang out or they're a TA. And honestly, this is a good size for it. I know it's big. I know it's like not the cutest of things, but I like my TA sitting close to me. And I think that this works really well. That is that. I think what I'm going to do right now is paint my letters. hands are very painted, but they are all painted. I'm gonna leave them there overnight, even though honestly they are drying really fast. I'm just gonna leave them there overnight. Other thing that I wanted to do today was get started on my new little wall thing. Maybe I'll just do that for like 15, 20 minutes. And then it is already 345, so I might just call it a day soon. Maybe I'll just sit and laminate for a little bit because I'm not doing anything anyways, but I do need to go wash my hands. <laughs> So let me go do that. Update. Excuse the loud noise. I'm sitting next to the AC unit, but basically I finished painting all of those and now I am laminating my new quote wall that I put on my door. Basically done laminating. I only have a couple more to laminate. Speaking of that, let's put the next one in. It is currently 4.38. Wanted to like not stay past like 4 p.m. Um, clearly, 
that didn't happen. But I think I might just kind of finish up with the laminating and be done there. Tomorrow, I kind of have a lot to do. I want to figure out what to do with that big wall tapestry that I brought. So I don't really know what to do with that yet. There's a lot of other things that I kind of want to do. I have to remind myself though that it doesn't need to be perfect today. Like school can start and my room doesn't have to be perfect and I can add things as I go. Um, and I feel like that's a good reminder for all of us teachers because a lot of times we see it and we think that like our classroom needs to be perfect on the first day and it really doesn't. There's also things that like, I hope I have a couple TAs this year that like my TAs can do for me um, that I don't wanna just have to spend the time doing. Like I wanna label all of my calculators, but like I necessarily don't need to do that. My TA could do that, like that type of stuff. So I think I, I'm probably just gonna finish off. I only have three more um, and then I'm gonna go home. I think my room is such a mess <laughs> But that's okay. That's just kind of how it's gonna be right now Normally, I'm not okay with it being a mess, but I kind of am okay right now with it being a mess So so I think I'm going to end today's video here um, I don't really feel like I did that much in my classroom today. Like I was out shopping for a lot of it, but I did get a lot of things that I wanted. Um, but we'll have a whole nother day. Got distracted. Let me put this in. We'll have a whole nother day tomorrow. Tomorrow is Wednesday. And then we have PD on Thursday and Friday. And it's actually like full days of PD. Um, I have something on Saturday. So I don't know if I'll be able to come in Saturday, but I'll definitely be coming in all day Sunday and then all day Monday. And then school starts Tuesday. Yeah, I'm really hoping I get a lot done tomorrow because I need to. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to y'all later. Bye.